After weeks of discussion and public comment, Ottawa County has approved a budget. The Board of Commissioners approved it in a meeting that went nearly seven hours long, not wrapping up until close to one o'clock this morning. 13 on your side's Julie Koharik joins us live in the newsroom with what made this such a hot topic. Yeah, over two hours of that meeting was comments from residents. It's been a heavily debated budget, largely because of potential health department cuts. Health Department Director Adeline Hambly is one of dozens of people who spoke against it. The finalized budget does cut some money from programs for substance abuse and suicide prevention. It also affects food assistance and education programs like Ottawa Food. While the board seemed to agree in support of that program, no one seemed to have an answer for how it would look after the cuts. There are more, more food establishments, more houses being built, more children going to school, more people having a hard time making ends meet, more people with food insecurity. I would not like the health department to cut this program. I don't think anyone does. And I would venture to guess nobody even in the room would want this program cut by the health department. Then let's reinstate the four and so, and cut. And so th those are my thoughts. Another item that had been debated in previous proposals was cutting the number of epidemiologists on staff from three positions to two, but commissioners decided last night to fund that third position. Administrator John Gibbs said last night he believes this budget meets all state minimum requirements for the health department, something Hambly had concerns about during previous talks. The budget passed with a 7-3 vote, with the new budget taking effect October 1st. In the newsroom, Julie Goharic, 13 on your side.